So we are taking 10,000 Ghana cities as a basis for the calculation. And I want to look at the calculation for 91 days, for 182 days, and then for 364 days for the um, 10,000. So what you do is that the interest rate for 91 days is 15.86. So just take your calculator and let's try it together. So just type 15.86. Have you done that? 15.86. Then divide the 15.86 by 100. And that will give you 0 0.1586. 0 0.1586. Let me start again. We are using, for the purpose of the presentation, we are going to use the discounted rate for this week, which is 15.86. The others, but let's just keep with 15.86. And we are investing 10,000 Ghana cities for one year, six months, and 91 days. So we are going to do the calculation for all. So that those of us who are at home who are watching, who want to know how they can do the calculation, you get to know it now. So the rate is 15.86. So just type, take your calculator and type 15.86. The next thing you do is that divide the 15.86 by 100. So on your calculator, 15.86 divided by 100 and that will give you 0 0.1586 0 0.1586 now if you are doing it for 91 days or three months you will divide the 0 0.1586 by four you divide the 0 0.1586 by four and if you do that you are going to get 0 0.0 03965 0 0.03965 and then you multiply it by the amount you are investing which is 10000 if you multiply it what you are going to get you are going to get 396.50 so it means that if you invest 10000 CDs for 91 days at the rate of 15.86 the interest you are going to get for the 91 days is 396.5 Ghana cities. So that is for 91 days if you are going with the rate of 15.86. Now let's assume that you want to do 10,000 again. But this time you want to do for 182 days or 6 months. Again, the rate for the 6 months is 16.92. So you type 16. 16.92 16.92 the same principle applies divide the 16.92 by 100 divided by 100 i'm going to get 0 0.1692 0 0.961 0 0.1692 and then if you are doing for six months you divide it by two and not by four if you are doing for six months after you have Divided the rate by 100, the figure that you get, you divide it by 2 if it's for 6 months. So we have 0 0.1692 divided by 2. And that gives us 0 0.0846. 0 0.0846. And then again, you multiply this 0 0.0846 by the amount that you want to invest, which is what? 10,000 Ghana cities. And that will give you. 846 Ghana cities. So it means that if I have 10,000 and I'm going for 182 days, I'm going to make <clears throat> 846 Ghana cities as my interest for six months. Now let's go to if you want to do it for one year. So the 10,000 again, I want to invest it for one year. The rate for the discounted rate is uh, the interest rate, sorry, is 18.96. 18.96. So the same principle applies again. You type 18.96 divided by 100. And that will give you 0 0.1896. If you are doing it for one year, you don't divide it by any number. So you just multiply the same um, 0 0.1896 directly by the amount that you are investing. So it's going to be 0 0.1896 times 10,000 cities that we want to invest. And that gives us 1,000 
896 Ghana cities. So for 10,000, if I'm doing for one year, the interest is 1,896. If I'm doing for six months, the interest is 